next shift is here at GMBB Kuala Lumpur for Malaysia's first major keyboard meetup. So it's quite a big deal because hey, us Malaysians are getting our very own big keyboard meetup. So let's go inside and take a look at the brands, vendors, as well as keyboards that they have on display that excites us and some that maybe do not excite us quite as much. So without further ado, let's go. Uh, my name is Byron and this is Wilson. Right, so we are actually based in Penang and one of our designers is actually based in Bali, Indonesia. So it's like basically two islanders having the same brand and same vision as well. So what we primarily, you know, uh, specialize is, is in we make, we used to make arclic keyboards, but then we have slowly moved on to actually making CNC keyboards. So we try to have a variety of different options as well for keyboards. So we have a Type 60, which is a hot stoppable uh, top uh, configuration so for the 60% which you have WinKey, WinKeyless and HHKB and also the Type 65 Plus that has a left macro column that's inspired by the Gear Mini actually. So uh, these are all the prototype units you're looking at. So we have V1 to V4 and you also have the 65% in the production units. They will be shipped in the next two weeks. As for future plans, I think uh, usually it's like we will focus on whatever that we started off. So we will just finish off the 65 and the 60 but stay tuned in our Discord channel for any further updates for any sneak peek as well. So we will usually make announcements to Instagram or even through the Discord channel. All right. Thanks, that's Axiom Studios. We are now at Singa KBD's booth, which is a Malaysian brand and unfortunately the founder uh, has social so she can't really talk on camera. But we know Singa KBD pretty well so let's talk about their booth here at the Malaysia Keyboard Meetup. This for example is a Kohaku t-shirt that they are selling as well as some sweaters and even a unicorn t-shirt which is quite nice. Aside from that you can also buy some keychain, caps and even the Ocelot is here for purchase if you are here at the Keyboard Meetup. And then there's also the Kohaku as well as the Unicorn which everyone loves. And there is also a special version of the Hex 4B, a collaboration between Singa KBD as well as Hex Keyboards. And no official details have actually been announced yet so that is actually quite exclusive in a way. And that's pretty much it. That's Singa KBD's booth right here at the Malaysia Keyboard Meetup. So we are Rebel Keyboards, I'm Hong and this is Jimmy, so we run this together. So basically we are a, mechanical, a custom mechanical keyboard parts vendor in Malaysia. So we sell parts for mechanical keyboards, we also do group buys for uh, keycaps, uh, for, keyboards, uh, for keyboard kits and all that for the Malaysia uh, region. Basically we have some stuff on display here, some of our own personal boards and some uh, stuff that we have run before, we have KK65, we have the Link 65 we have the Ginkgo, the Iki and all that and also, and also the QK60 which is coming really soon So yeah, this is all some, some stuff we have on display and we have the Royal Selango Artisan right there, you can see Yep, we have this on display, Mo uh, made full, uh, fully out of pewter from Royal Selango So very cool and very heavy <laughs> So yeah, that's basically all we have on display here. And also we have this new product that we just launched. So this is the this this is a Batek keyboard pouch. So it comes in two sizes, one small, one big. The larger one is for TKL. So this is actually made by uh, Dignity for Children a Foundation. It's a local NGO here that does uh, that does work for underprivileged children and all that. And this one, this is actually their, their initiative called Soul X Dignity. So they basically uh, they provide jobs, you know, in terms of sewing and all that to refugee mothers and all that and all in all the profit goes back to help the, help the Dignity for Children Foundation as well in terms of uh, education and all that for underprivileged children and yeah, this is basically our, our booth we are making waffles as well, uh, a bit funny but yeah, we have one actually sitting right there Alright, so just keep your eyes on Reebok Keyboards Uh, we're now at Monoke's booth at the Malaysia Keyboard Meetup and this is Caleb who he says is a janitor at the company so he's going to talk more about Monoke. Yeah. 
Uh, hi, I'm Caleb. Uh, I represent Monoke. Uh, Monoke is an input device studio. We're based in Singapore and Malaysia. Uh, we've been doing a lot of uh, keyboard related stuff and one of the recent stuff we've been doing uh, is the Jane V2ME, uh, a collab with TGR. Hi. And uh, the standard which we released uh, previously as well. Yeah. So uh, a lot of stuff we have on display is actually from last year, especially our friend series. Um, so a lot of the things like the Hero, the uh, Tomo, like the Neko, a whole bunch of stuff. We also brought out uh, the uh, review units for the standard. Uh, and of course the Jane V2, we have it there. That's uh, been very popular so far with a lot of people. Yeah. Right. Awesome. So last question. What are the future plans for Monoke? Because uh, we see that you guys have some collabs going on with like Singa KBD and yeah. even TGR. Yeah. Um, as always, I can't say much about it. Uh, but definitely keyboards, definitely uh, K caps. You know, one of the things that we did recently was the Kohaku K cap, which was the fish, the koi fish. I think a lot of people liked it. I think it got sold out a bit more quicker than we expected it to. Definitely looking to bring that back. Definitely looking to bring a lot more little things that uh, represent the Malaysian and Singapore scene. Uh, we feel that a lot of Malaysian designers, especially for TJR and Singa, a lot of people uh, locally don't get access to them, yeah. right? So a lot of things, it goes overseas. And we really want to make sure that we promote our local designers, both in Singapore, both in Malaysia, Indonesia, so and so forth. We want to represent Southeast Asia. So a lot of upcoming collabs are focused along that. So stay tuned. We will definitely uh, have a lot more things ready for you guys. Now we are at Hex Keyboards booth all the way from Singapore and we're going to talk to Wayne aka Caster on Discord. Hi, I'm Caster, otherwise known as Wayne from Hex Keyboards. We are a Singapore-based custom keyboard company, I suppose. We design and uh, say, not say manufacture, we design and sell our own custom keyboards. So as you can see over here, from 60% to 75% to 10 kilos, we have it all. We even have like a full size, but I was lazy to build it, so I didn't bring it. <laughs> Yeah I, I, yeah, I was too lazy. This one, I assembled about 12 hours ago. <laughs> Speed running it. It's not even sorted by the way. It's just like stuffed it in and shit. Yeah. I guess that's all you should know about Hex. <laughs> we'll be releasing this keyboard. It's a 60% playlist keyboard. Uh, plans to release it relatively soon. I think the plan is October the 10th, which is nine days away. In terms of plans moving forward, I suppose they're going to look to try and expand our keyboard range. But potentially, we can bring in more affordable stuff, maybe even a uh, custom pre-built keyboard, maybe, who knows, you know? Everyone loves customs, everyone loves in stock, so why not do a custom pre-built in stock keyboard? One day, one day, one day. So it's been a passion project, we've been building this from the ground up, and honestly, I like where we're going. It's, it's actually a very exciting space to be in right now with like tech innovation here and there. So looking, for, looking forward to see the keyboard, the keyboard scene grow in the next few, in the next few years. Lah. Awesome. It's going to be fun, it's going to be fun, yeah. Thanks for having me on this uh, oh, show. Thanks uh, for yeah. talking to us. Uh, so remember to check out Hex Keyboards if you're in Singapore or even if you're in Malaysia. Anywhere in the world. <laughs> <laughs>Now we have a brand all the way from Korea, which is KLC, and we're gonna talk about what they have on display and their future plans. Uh, okay, Selamat Siang, right? Hello, uh, this is Kevin from KLC. Really nice to meet you guys in, in here in Malaysia. And KLC is running custom keyboard and offering people like um, uh, designers uh, work in uh, ways of keyboard or deskmats or other uh, artisan maker uh, artisans and I brought some of the products um, that I'm going to offer in next month or so if you can uh, follow up in KLC discord I will um, give you guys more information uh, on through the um, discord and for now I must say I want to introduce this um, this Nori it's more affordable uh, keyboard, uh, custom keyboard that supports like uh, wireless and Bluetooth. This is designed by Syrian, but uh, more designers uh, version will come out next, like TGL and Singa keyboard. I hope you guys uh, like our offer, and this will be uh, everything included, like keycaps and uh, switches for like 140 US dollars. So uh, I'll be, I, I want to bring more people to this custom keyboard hobby uh, and be our friend. So thank you.
If you're in Penang, you may have heard of Click and Brew, which combines coffee as well as keyboard. But today is just the brew part of the show, and we're going to talk to the owners right now. Hi, my name is Joey. I'm Erica. So we are a cafe plus a mechanical keyboard workshop as well. We are a mechanical keyboard experience studios and we also set up the coffee studio at the same space. So people can come in while they're looking at the keyboards, they can also enjoy a cup of coffee and they don't have to rush out. They can take their time. Uh, we have empty space that people can sit down uh, while they actually talk to their friends about keyboards or they come just for the coffee and not really keyboards. Uh, today's we have muffin. We have a uh, cold brew matcha and cold brew hojicha. And from the machines, we have the white and the black, uh, which is the latte. And we have a specialty brand, roasted with our roaster. So it has a uh, Colombia, Indonesia, and Ethiopian beans in there. It's, we call it a double chocolate fudge because it's very chocolatey. Because you guys are just in Penang right now. So are there any plans to be in other parts of Malaysia? This is a really great question and um, a lot of people have asked this question as well. So we are kind of very small startup. Basically, we are the only employees <laughs> <laughs> and also the founders. Um, for now, we kind of enjoy the pace that is slow and we can engage with every customer who work in. And it's more intimate as well for us to know them, the story that they brought into our cafe. Uh, we expect to, hopefully we can expand and, and scale in future. When we start to more family with the current process, you know, handling the customer on the mechanical keyboard side and also the coffee side. It's going to be in the future plan, not going to be near future, but we want to carefully uh, looking into what we currently do best and probably expand it in, in future. So we are now at Sun Cycles booth and they have a lot of brands including Akko, Kikron as well as Ducky which is my personal favorite for a pre-build anyway. So we're going to talk to Jin to talk about the brand. Hi there. Hi. Hi. Oh, hi. <laughs> hi. Okay, actually Sun Cycle is a gaming component distributor. So yeah, we are we're actually celebrating our 7th anniversary this year. So we're actually covering 6 brands today. So we actually have we have, have Shuriki, Vamilo, Ducky, Glorious, Aqua, and Techway. We're actually, actually having special discount. I mean, special price today for people who came to this event. Any plans for like even more keyboards? Oh, definitely, definitely. My boss mentioned just now he wants everything under one roof. If can, okay. if it's possible. Mm -hmm. Yep. All right. That yep. Would be great. We yep. are looking forward to that. Yep. <laughs> thank okay. you, thank you, Jin. All right, so check out Sun Cycle and they have a lot of products there under them. You might be buying them and now you know that Sun Cycle is the official distributor. We are now at Silky's booth which is actually a keyboard cable maker based right here in Malaysia and we're going to talk to them right now. Hi, uh, my name is Faris and I run Silky KBD. So uh, I, we mainly uh, build custom cables for keyboards and what we do is we try to color match uh, the cables to the keyboards so that they can get like a nice accessory that comes with the keyboard that they uh, usually you know, customize. So over here, like we, you can see all the different types of combinations that uh, we offer. We actually have over more than 10,000 different combinations that you can come up with. Um, so there's the paracord, which is the underlying color, and then there's the tag flex, which goes over the paracord to give a secondary color. And so what you get at the end of it is cables that are this colorful, <laughs> basically. Uh, at the moment, like the upcoming project is like we're trying to plan to work on uh, gradient cables. So like these are actually cables that I dyed myself. So we like we dye it to make like a gradient uh, gradient finish to it. So you can see like it goes from white to purple and then in the future maybe hopefully like one day keyboards Ooh. yeah but that that's still in the works so yeah if you're a fan of artisans then you might have heard of ready keycaps so we're going to talk to them about what they have on display today Hello, hi, I'm Sabrina. 
uh, the owner of Trendy Key Camps. So I mainly sell artisans. My specialty is anime artisans like One Piece, uh, Valorant or Demon Slayer. But now I'm branching out into artisan trays as well. Then we have uh, switch holders and magnetic holders. So yeah, future plans, maybe macro pet first, then keyboard. <laughs> Thank you. So that's Trendy Key Caps. If you guys are into anime artisans, I mean, who isn't? <laughs> Just check them out. Okay, so we're at Mecca Store's booth, good friends with us, and they will be coming to Malaysia, and Mr. Raid here will tell us more about it. Hello fellow Malaysians, I'm not Malaysian, what did I say that? If you see this banner, it says coming Q4 2022. But let me preface that, in the keyboard world, you know, dates are pretty flexible, there are suggestions. But this is not, we are definitely coming. We are definitely coming to Bandar Sunway at the end of this year sometime, hopefully if no delays with construction. So, we want to bring the experience that we have in Singapore, right here in Malaysia. I want to say KL, but it's not really KL, it's Sunway. Right, watch out for it. Please, when it launches, our good friend Andrew will definitely be invited and we'll show you the good stuff. We have three boards that we designed internally. So the Kawaiyo, which is, has run, the Gruba has run. Uh, it's trying to be fulfilled right now. We have some QC issues, but you know, whatever. Uh, we have the Ananis, the nice, beautiful, purple, shiny PVD backplate finish board that is in close group by. We are hoping to release that in a different uh, colorway in the future, but same form factor. And we also have the LAN, which is an Alice style board, uh, which is also needs a redesign because we want to bring it down to a better price point for consumers. And a lot of people didn't like the, the fin design. So those are the three boards that we have designed. Other than that, you know, we have the other special stuff. We have the modes on it with moon drop switches. I believe the only one here today. And we also have a Tiger 80 uh, with uh, ceramic keycaps. I believe we're also the only one here today. If you are traveling to Singapore, we have opened our level two, uh, which is a nicer experience, not as scuffed as what was before, uh, much more relaxed space. And I, I hope you guys can come down and visit us there. Awesome. So if you're in Singapore, give Mecca Store a visit and wait, await for the Malaysian arrival of this, Akan data. Yeah, make us stop. <laughs> we are very excited. We are very excited. And that is it for Malaysia's first ever major keyboard meetup. There were a lot of people and even more exciting keyboards for everyone to try out. Hopefully there will be another one next year and if there is one, you will be sure to see us there next year as well. This is Andrew for Next Rift, signing off.